X431 ADAS. Calibration tool is proudly released by launch to the automotive ADAS calibration market. It is designed to calibrate the camera and radar-based ADAS sensors of the vehicle after the sensors have been removed, replaced, or repaired. X431 ADAS has wide vehicle coverage including Mercedes-Benz, Bavarian Motorworks, Audi, and more. X431 ADAS is ready to use. It provides OE-level calibration accuracy, multiple calibration functions, and wide vehicle coverage. Park the vehicle on the flat ground. Keep the front wheel in a straight line. Keep all the doors closed and the vehicle vacant. Check the tire pressures of four wheels are within the standard range. Firstly, connect the diagnostic tool with the vehicle. Choose the correct diagnostic software and enter the calibration system. According to the on-screen instructions, choose the corresponding calibration panel and install it onto the calibration frame. And then move the frame to the required distance and also keep the frame centered to the vehicle. Observe the T-shaped level gauge bubble of the calibration frame and adjust the four adjustment screws of the base support of the frame to keep the horizontal and vertical bubbles in the middle. When the bubble goes one side, tighten the adjustment screw on the other side. Attach the wheel clamps on the two rear wheels of the vehicle. Observe the level gauge bubble of the wheel clamp. If not in the middle, Adjust the position of wheel clamp on the rim flange of tire. Then turn on the laser module to allow the laser beam hit on the scale of the cross member of the calibration frame. If not, adjust the laser module to the desired level. Observe if the left and right scale of the cross member projected from the wheel clamp laser modules show the same values. If not, move the calibration frame laterally to adjust it as desired. Turn on the laser module of the calibration frame to allow the laser beam hit on scale panel of the wheel clamp. If not, adjust the laser module to the appropriate position. Observe if the left and right scale of the wheel clamps projected from the cross member laser modules show the same values. If not, turn the calibration frame axially to adjust it as desired. After all above operations are properly done, fix the calibration frame by tightening the adjustment screws of the base support to keep it unmovable during the testing. Rotate the crank handle to move the calibration panel to the height indicated in the diagnostic software. Follow the instruction on the screen to finish the calibration.